Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to be showing you a few things in Photoshop with MX Simulator. Uh, well, the first thing you want to do is, you, of course, you gotta have your um, you have to have your Photoshop. Um, there's crack things if you look up on YouTube. Uh, Photoshop CS5 cracked and things, but um, as you can see, here is my uh, here is the uh, thing with it and there's Photoshop right here so let's minimize this what you want to do is uh, we're gonna work on that today just a simple template you can download any other templates and uh, this is what you're gonna do uh, you wanna make them you can download them uh, you can download them off the forum on MX Simulator of course Pure MXS is down their website has shut down because of uh, other things that has happened so what you're going to do is right click and if you already know how to um, open it then just open it okay so to open this hit open with Adobe Photoshop CS5 if you're running it as administrator that's probably going to say no just click yes okay so it's going to open it and you're automatically going to get 33.3 .3. now what I like to do is either zoom up at 100 or 50 just to get a just to get an image of what it is and this is your layers bar so if you're saying what, what you want to do like uh... like put your number on it you want to hit text and down here's your colors and of course we're not going to use black because the because the back fender or the side fender plate is obviously black so we're obviously going to use white so what you want to do is just click the text bar which was right here. Choose your color. That's gonna bring you to this bar. So uh, my number is 24. So we're just gonna once you type that in or whatever you want, you go up here and hit the move bar, or just hit enter. Doesn't really matter. And since that's not gonna fit, you can come up to this corner right here, and you can kind of uh, grab that corner and you can make it smaller or bigger or whatever you want. I mean, you turn it sideways, and you can just put it there. So that kind of looks like your number now. So uh, that's that side. And if you don't feel like doing the text and doing that again, you can hit Enter for. If, okay, you already hit Done. So you can right-click on it, and go to Duplicate Layer, hit OK, take that, and you can move it wherever you want. Once again, you can just flip it around right there. I already have this because I'm on. I'm looking for a team because I make my own skins and stuff. We'll get to that in the next video. So that's that one. And if you still don't feel like making it, just do the same thing. Right click and duplicate layer. Just turn it this way. Oh. turn it now see how is it kind of come comes up as a, a square that's not perfectly aligned now if you want to just take it and make it kind of like cool kind of like uh, like that or like that just drag it down to the bottom but what you want to do is um, take it you kind of want to make it smaller because the front fender is really small and then you kind of want to twist it back around and then what you just can just paste it on it and uh, what you want to do now is if you're not done you want to create things just you can hit the paint tool right here the gradient tool will get in that to the next video you can pick different gradients that's from um, a track that I made off of Photoshop usually you can make tracks with the track editor on MX Simulator by going into properties and just switching out uh, how it opens but also if, if you don't feel like doing it the easy way which most people do like doing well they like doing it the easy way you can do it the hard way and don't mind that and you can just make a track doing it the photoshop ways now that takes a little long that takes a little while so anyways um, to save this you wanna hit file 
and save as. Now a lot of people ask, what do you name the bikes? It's actually fairly simple. So we're gonna obviously place this to the desktop. You can place it in any folder you want, doesn't matter. Um don't mind that. Uh you're gonna name it KX two fifty or four fifty, whatever you want, and dash. Then it doesn't matter, two thousand eleven. You can name it whatever you want, but that I think that might have to be there. I don't think it has to though. Yeah, it doesn't have to. And then all you have to do is type whatever you want. So I'm just gonna put uh example. Oops. Okay, and what you wanna do is go down here to where it says Photoshop and go down here to where it says PNG. Photoshop image, whatever the thing is called. Oh that's JPEG, my bad and then you hit save it's gonna ask you uh, PNG options and interlace no hit OK you can it's gonna wait a couple seconds mine looks to say not responding just because it reloads really quick it does that and then it says that right there because I, I'm on the gradient tool so okay, that doesn't really matter so that's the one thing that we had that's our template and then here is your thing so um let's I'll show you how to open that so if you have go into your MX simulator personal folder or your MX simulator uh, uh, directory I can just uh, click on my folders and hit MX simulator but if you don't know how to get to MX simulator you can go um, go to your start menu go to computer win 7 program files 86 if you have a 64-bit computer uh, you can scroll down to the M's for MX Simulator, and it should be right there. There's MX Simulator. This is all my files. I know I have a lot of files because I make skins and stuff. So what you want to do is make sure you have your JAM files for this, and place that in there. See, and then we have it in there, and so I'm going to see if my recording thing gets games so let's open up MX simulator just for a second I know you can't see that um, default screen windowed switch to that oh, hold on I'm just trying to get this whoa what the heck Ooh, windowed I don't know what the heck was that was doing. Okay, so that's there. Okay, so uh, I'm just going to load this up really quick. I know I didn't select the bike. I just want to see if I can get the track loaded. Okay, so this is my skin. I made this. I know it's probably lagging for you guys. I'm sorry. But I just want to show you this. Alright, so... Um, where's the example? Um, I'm just trying to find it really quick. Oh, I'm on RMZ. That's why. My bad, guys. You want to go to uh, the KX250, and it should be down here. I'm trying to find it. Decal work, stock quickness. Example right here. Alright, now let's see if this works. Okay, it worked. So, just to prove to you guys, I am in the one mode. And I'll just show that it worked. See, and there's your skin. There's your number. So, that's about it, guys. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. And if you have any comments or anything to ask just leave a comment below and we'll see you in the next video